A group of motorcyclists are in Lynchburg tonight. It's part of the 29th annual Run for the Wall. It's an annual ride to Washington in an effort to promote healing among veterans and honor those killed in combat as well as those still missing in action. And the veterans get an added bonus along the way thanks to a lunch with students that's now become a tradition. Would you look at that line of motorcycles? Man, that's beautiful. Nice sunny skies right there. Today, the riders were spending quality time with Montvale Elementary School students. Each year, the mm -hmm. kids give the veterans a welcome that many didn't get when they returned home from war. This is something the students, as well as the veterans, look forward to every year. And it's a chance for both of them, really, to develop some lasting friendships. It's absolutely amazing to see little guys out there with flags and waving and then to be in the classroom with these kids and, and get cards, it's, it's just touching, really touching. Uh, that's what it's all about. We're really here just to honor them and uh, make their trip a little easier. You know, they've been on the road for, uh, golly, nearly 10 days by the time they get here. So we just really like to uh, ease their ride and help them in their journey. After lunch, the riders visited the D-Day Memorial, then continued on their Harley Davidsons to uh, Lynchburg, where they will rest for the night there. They will meet up with hundreds of other veterans this weekend in D.C. I think that amazing. shot of all, I mean, it's great what the kids do, and, and it really touches uh, the, the sure. veterans' hearts, and, and I'm sure the Vietnam the veterans the most. But yeah. that shot of all those Harleys coming Seeing them all, like, it's was, beautiful. It's pretty impressive. And good right? timing, because unfortunate if they would have had to driven through yesterday. Oh man, right? yeah, well, they lose. Yeah. yeah, what a great welcome. So, all right, <laughs> glad everything worked out.